Howdy folks, this is Checkers, and well, this is Star Citizen. It's been a while, I know, it's been a while for me since I've done much of anything, whether it was videos or even just playing. I have been under the weather for quite a while, and I don't just mean my default condition, but I am feeling a bit more energetic, and I thought we might give a Star Citizen a whirl. We're getting to about the time that Starfield would have launched, but as it is a bit behind, I thought we might try this. All right, let's see. And ground floor. Now I'm a bit rusty, but we'll see if I can't knock some of that off along the way. All right. Uh, let's see. Okay, we've got some street clothes on. We've got some undersuits and... We've got some armor. Got some weapons. And some ammo. All right. Um, well, in that case, I think we can just kind of meander over here. We've got food and drink. You can see that in the bottom left corner. 100% hydration and 100% satiation for food. Now, what was I about to think? I think we should look for... I even have some money. Look at that. Oh, right. I did the... Um, Oh, the event. I'm so sorry. My memory is considerably worse than it used to be. But, you know, we get to relearn everything together. Let's see. We want a job. Let's try... Research, maintenance, bounty hunter. I don't see any, um... Oh, what's the word I want? Delivery jobs. I did warn you, my memory is more damaged. It's been a long couple of years. But, but, spaceships and flying and things and stuff, it'll be great. And if it looks a little choppy, Star Citizen is a little choppy when it first loads in. And it's been a while since I've loaded in. But also, the recording software, and I'm trying to use some noise removal. That's helping me run an air filter so I can breathe better, and some fans to keep the room cool. So, this is a more powerful rig than I had before. I think I might have mentioned that that one passed on, but um, I'm asking a lot out of it right now. Okay, train will be here in just a little bit. If I can, I'll see if I can uh, cut some of that time for you. And here we go. City flight reminds you. Hop in. in Alright, let's take another look at the contract manager and see if we can't get lucky. I know I don't have any. Um, well, maybe once we get off world, we might get lucky. I suppose we could always try and pick up some bounty hunting, but I'd really rather start out with some delivery. All right, I will shorten the tram ride for you one way or another. Maybe I'll just speed it up so you can get an idea of the scale without having to sit through the entire thing. world can't pick us up some work. Rock. 
Riker Memorial Spaceport. Okay, quick check. I'm pretty sure I don't have any crime stat issues. No outstanding fines. That's what I like to see. Okay, what was that? Uh, the Siege of Arisen, that was the event I did where I made so much money. That was a lot of fun. Um, huge, sprawling thing. Okay, let's see here. Welcome to the ASOP Vehicle Retrieval System. Okay. Okay, um, let's see. I love this. The Anvil C8X. Stand by. Standing by. Your vehicle has been delivered to the following location. Well, thank you. And so off to Hangar 3 we go. And... You know what, let's check. Personal inventory sustenance. We've got some drinks and some food. Just gotta remember to take it with us when we go. Okay. There we go. It takes all of us working together to keep our course. And you're three. And you can actually zoom in on these if you just scroll in while you press the use key. Alright, not the biggest ship in the game by far, but I think one of the coolest. Just small and sleek and handy, especially for the smaller delivery jobs. So not really hauling cargo, but carrying, you know, smaller items from A to B. Okay, let's hop on in and close our door. And I'm just gonna start the ship up so we can get our shields warming up while we get dressed and take some things with us. Okay, and press R to ready the ship and then we're just gonna hop out of the seat while it warms up. Okay, so open our inventory and take a look. So, uh, let's take our clothes off and we're going to be placing these in the local inventory at area 18 here. And uh, grab ourselves an undersuit. Oh, you know what? We'll do it simple this time. We'll just grab the Novikov here and the helmet we can find here. And a Novikov backpack. So now on this side of our screen, we'll have personal inventory, and we've got a core compartment, and should have our backpack. Whoop, there it is. Okay, so let's also pick up from local inventory. That's area 18 inventory. We'll grab a pistol. And a C-54 submachine gun. Come over here to ammo. This is a mag for this pistol. We'll grab a couple of those. And a couple mags for the C-54. Okay, and some sustenance. We might find stuff in our travels, but we'll just grab a bar and a drink. I think the vehicle actually has a bottle in it, if I saw. Yeah, okay. So, close up our inventory. Head back to our seat. Okay. Now, let's call Area 18 Landing Services here and ask for permission to take off. You are clear to launch. Thank you kindly. Take a look up. Watch the doors go. Okay, I swear I can remember how this works. I've done pretty well so far. Alright, put our gear up. We can take a look outside and watch that. Alright. 
and all right so let's set our speed and just head out of atmosphere okay and while we're doing that let's take another look at the contracts manager just to see thank you and please visit again you bet I will all right So, the little blue arrows, kind of carrots, there are two, one at the top moving across the screen, one on the right side just by the strut, and one down by the thing that says no target. Those are other players or other ships. I think white means unoccupied, and the kind of light blue means basically friendly occupied, or presumably friendly. Not currently hostile, or not currently criminal. I am no expert at this, but uh, I do love the game, and it's gotten me through some really hard times. Okay, so let's set ourselves a course for... First, let's hit Baijini. This is a space station that orbits Area 18 here. Where is my marker? There it is. Okay. We'll light up our quantum drive. I'll try and hold her steady long enough to spool up. Off we go. I don't necessarily know that we're going to dock, but we will swing close and see if that updates our options for work. Turn off our quantum drive. Going to zip in close kind of quick. I just love this thing. It's tiny, and it's fast, and it's nimble, and it's not going to win you a whole bunch of fights or anything, but it is just a glorious little boat. Okay, so I'm just going to drift close here. Let's... We're not actually going to contact to land. Let's just check our contracts manager again. Nothing. mercenary okay well I guess maybe somebody's just picking them up that was a quick look at the player list oh you know what I guess we can dock I just looks like I need a drink anyway um oops there we go uh oh Please proceed to sign landing bay. Can perhaps do. Okay. Okay, like I said, a little rusty. We'll get there. and gentle. And gear down. Landing gear deployed. A little too slow. Okay. And let's... You know, let's sit down. Maybe we'll hop in and restart or try and get another server and see if we luck out. First, though, Landing complete. Have a pleasant stay. thank you kindly. We'll take care of our vehicle maintenance. A little bit of repair, a little bit of refueling. And we can cut our engines. Okay, we're inside, so I can take my helmet off. And actually, here, let's throw it in the backpack. And have a drink here. And drink.
And the great thing, we don't need that much. We'll have one more drink and then we'll store it. Okay, and we'll stow that back. And just because forgetting is a terrible, terrible thing, put that old helmet right back on. Not much worse than going outside and realizing you forgot to put your helmet back. Okay, um... And close that up. Okay, we'll take one quick look at the contracts manager since we're on station. Wait, wait, wait. Something new came up. No, I think it's investigation, maybe. Okay, I had my heart set on a delivery, so... We'll see if we can't do that. I'll head into the station, store the ship, and restart. See if we can't get another server that might have some delivery missions on tap. Um, wow. Didn't even have to go in the elevator. Kind of took care of it for me, I think. Okay. And come over here to the ASOP terminal. Welcome to the ASOP vehicle retrieval system. And here we go. Store. Not sure why I have a Hornet. The rest of this, I think, is mine. Okay, anyway. I think you, you get ships every once in a while to for various things. Like maybe a bug or, or as a loner of some kind. Uh, anyway, let me uh, bounce out and see if I can't pick up another server. And we'll see how this goes. Okay, and we are back here waking up in Baijini. And we will pop this open quick and take a look. And still nothing. Okay, let me... Delphi, I think, tracks your uh, reputation. Bounty Hunter's Guild, Civilian Defense. Kovalax is one of the deliveries. It looks like I've done a little bit for them. Um, actually, I guess I should look and see if we're even on the same server. Honestly, I can't tell. Alright. You know what we'll do? We'll fly somewhere else. That'll show them. Alright. Uh, quick look. And make sure that we have our helmet on. It's always better to be safe than sorry. Um... I kind of enjoy the delivery missions. They're chill. Plus you get to fly your spaceship. Okay. Um, so we're here on Baijini Point, the space station. There's the hospital here, the moonwalking nurse. Um, I guess we'll take a quick look around as long as we're here. Head up to hangar. Or, sorry, the uh, cargo center. And... Trip a little bit. I'm gonna watch that. Somebody left a paper clip on the floor or something. Okay, maybe I tripped on a shadow. You're all wondering why I've gathered you here together? I can't tell you because I don't know myself. But I have faith that each and every one of you will perform your tasks to the best of your abilities. Now, after calisthenics, I expect you to fall out and complete your duties for the day. Thank you. Okay, basically, I think that means that we just spawned this area for the first time in a while. In other words, no one's been here for a while. And there we have a classic T-pose. Way to go, sister. Um, you can pick up the very cool gray cat armor here. 
And uh, this, this is the Novikov set that I'm wearing. And you can buy things from these terminals, or you can pretty much pick them up right off the, uh, the mannequins here. You can also pick up things like backpacks and these Grey Cat uh, multi-tools, clothes, helmets you don't want to wear out in space, and, you know, some fashion footwear for the work-minded individual. Oh, yeah, and you can actually pick up some drinks here. You know what? Let's grab an extra quick. And we will store this one. And we've got some food. Food usually lasts uh, a bit longer. So, you know, I guess if we don't get to a delivery mission, at least we're getting to have some fun looking around. Yep. It's impressive. That's another kind of helmet you don't want to wear out in space. And they do sell them in shops. I had a friend who bought one because he thought it looked cool. It did not work out so well for him. Okay. And we'll call our elevator and hop on in. And head on down to hangers and habs. And... Here we are again. That's where we came out of over there is the uh, apartment building kind of thing and the hospital. The Galleria is kind of a food court, but there's also a hot dog joint right here with some food and drinks. And you can come over here and also take a look out at the station exterior, that sort of central ring. Okay. Um, wow, I've probably kind of worn out my welcome for the moment. I don't know that we're going to get to do a cargo mission, or I mean delivery mission today, but maybe next time. Um, maybe welcome we can at least the ASOP vehicle retrieval system. fly somewhere else quick. Vehicle selected. Stand by. And see if we can find something. Your vehicle has been delivered to the following location. Hangar 3 is our lucky hangar today. Calling elevator. Okay. And hangar three. Uh, worth noting is that there's a big sort of like, if you've ever been to like a car show or a boat show or a home show, there's a spaceship show in Star Citizen called the Intergalactic Aerospace Expo, the IAE, and it is coming up, I believe, on November 18th of 2022. And I would very much like to share that if I can. Okay, and hop in the boat. All right. Different ships have different ways to close their doors. Some are buttons on the side, some you touch the door, some it's just kind of floating in space like this one. Oh, actually, there's also... Um, couple of jump seats here. Jump seat there and there because uh, now there is actually some physical implications to taking off and bumpy rides. So if you're not seated or laying down in a bed, you can get tossed around quite a bit. Okay. Okay. One more look just because I'm stubborn. Nothing. Okay. Well, can't win them all. Um, let's call Baijini. Oh, right. Turning on the ship is always helpful. Anthem Aerospace. All systems online. Okay, we could also kind of heat up our shields a little faster. If we take this little thing right here with our mouse and zip it over to 100, our shields aren't so massive that it takes a while to warm up. It's just sort of something I usually do. So we can click this back in the center. No, really? I swear we can. Oh, I was trying to do that with uh, that blue icon instead of my mouse pointer. Can't take me anywhere. All right, and we are going to call by Genie. No, really, I'm doing it again, aren't I? Can't take me anywhere. What is that blue icon? Okay. You are clear to launch. All righty. And we'll just kind of lift up a little bit there. And put our gear up. 
Our little wingtips will fall down. I what else we can do. Let's go to Microtech. This is going to take a while, so you won't have to take this ride with me. But let's set ourselves to New Babbage there. Okay. And head on out. Okay, what do we got? Okay, that was pointing to our hangar. That one's pointing to New Babbage, I will bet. Let's spin up our Thank quantum you. drive. Oh, Please. it's an orbital marker. So basically, we've got to go around Arc Corp to get around to New Babbage. Okay, let's jet a little faster as our drive spools up, and then cool back down under the... So into red, we're into afterburners, I believe. Okay. There we go. We're all spooled up. And... Okay. And this next jump is going to be a while. So I might just say goodbye for now. And maybe we'll try this again next time. Okay, we're spooled up. So we're 59 million kilometers away, and we are in quantum drive, so we're moving along at quite a rate, but it's still going to take a while. So I will say for now, thank you so much for joining me on our not quite successful attempt at doing a delivery mission in Star Citizen. But like I said, I thought it would be nice to fly around in a spaceship roughly close to when Starfield was supposed to launch. I do adore Star Citizen, and I do have fun. I, I have to say, I really do, and I really hope I can share that fun with you folks. For the moment, though, I would like to say thank you so much for watching. I hope you found the video entertaining and maybe even just a little bit informative. I would like to invite you to think of something you are truly grateful for. Something which brings a smile to your face, a true warmth to your heart. Hang on to it, whatever it is, and let it brighten your day. And, you know, if you had some fun, maybe consider just clicking that old like button or, or maybe even subscribing. It, maybe I should really get back into doing this. That would help me know if, if I should. Alrighty, folks. Thank you again, and please, most of all, please take care.